Hello, Muggle World. Um, so, um, I've been kind of wanting to do this for a while now. Um, it's it's something that I've had to kind of wait to get permission from the ministry and from a few others. And so I'm going to do this. And I guess I got a little bit of pull from the uh, the the head of the Minister of Magic and all that. Um, but yes, so. My name is Kay Weasley. Yes, I'm one of those Weasleys. I am Ronald's twin. Um, and you're probably thinking, wait, I don't remember you. Well, there's a reason for that. Um, for whatever reason, Joanne wrote me out of the story. So, because of that oversight, I'm here to tell you a little bit about my story and about what I've been doing since graduation and to kind of give you some information on what my brother's been doing and what the family's been up to. Uh, also, answer some questions. I'm sure you've got those dying questions of, so, you know, what kind of shampoo do you guys use at Hogwarts? Or um, I've even seen a couple of things of, does it cost to send owls at the gallery? Um, stuff like that. So I'm here to kind of answer you guys some questions. Uh, one thing I've been doing, um, pretty much what I grew up to be, is work for my dad at the ministry in the Misuse of Muggle Artifacts. And um, pretty much I've chosen to live a muggle life. And I've, you know, gotten to know the different things and, you know, just did the normal muggle things and found out what the use of a rubber duck is daddy don't worry i've got the answer for that now um and just so that way we know at the ministry of how it's being misused by knowing how it's being used uh the one thing though i have noticed with you muggles or nomads as they're called in america um is that you guys misuse your own things. I mean, I even saw someone take one of those uh, trolleys that we've got in the UK, um, shopping carts, I think they're called in parts of America, and I've pe seen people, like, stuffing their friends in it and pushing each other around or even putting motors on them and driving them. I even saw somebody tear one apart and use it to cook on. So, you muggles already, you misuse your own thing. So, for us to add a little magic to it, is it really so bad? So, that's pretty much what Daddy and I had been talking about, you know, while I was growing up. I'm like, but Daddy, um, they, you know, misuse their own things. Is it really so bad for what we do? And, you know, how do we know what they use them for? And how we would misuse them. So eventually he talks um, his boss into letting me do a muggle life. And actually, you know, learn things. So um, I'm going to eventually put my own channel right now. This little audio podcasty thing. Um, I'm going to post this on my muggle roommate Sharon's channel. So you guys have seen her, Ginger Princess. She's been posting her little vloggy things. And... A lot of people say we look alike, but, you know, whatever. I might use a polyjuice potion every now and then. But, you know, that's just side stuff. Don't don't worry about that. Um, so I've been... You might kind of notice my accent's a little different than my brother's and may change from word to word. Um, I have been traveling a lot with this job for Dad. And, you know, sometimes I sound a little bit more like my Irish friends and sometimes I sound a bit more like my Australian friends and sometimes I sound like my American friends. So um, it just comes and goes so don't be alarmed when you hear a word that's not quite right. Um, right now you're only going to get my audio diaries and I'm going to do a little bit of Q&A. Uh, one of the other things I want to do on this channel is to talk about you know, telling my favourite stories, you know, my time at Hogwarts, telling some fun stories on my brother Ron and telling some of the weird things that Harry did as a student, things that you didn't see in the movies or that Joe didn't write about. 
Um, and just, you know, really, one of the th big things is answering your questions. Uh, that's the one thing I'm mainly here for. I had to get permission from the minister, Hermione, <coughs> and, you know, and get some permission from dad and everybody to just get out there and talk to you guys and let you know that we are here, that, you know, what you see in, you know, what was written and put out there in the documentaries, um, some were real, some were not, uh, some were, you know, romanticized, some things, like, I wish we did that, that was pretty cool, um, but, so yeah, I want to get out there and tell my story, because being Ron's sister is hard enough, you know, getting glossed over, you know, he married Hermione, and my little sister Jenny married Harry, and I him in the background. I kind of feel like the way the, that they did to Charlie. My big brother Charlie got blown off in the movies and my big brother Bill barely got any, you know, notice. But, you know, I got even less time and less noticed, as in none at all. So I'm here to um, talk to you guys and, and to tell my side of the story and kind of the behind the scenes what they didn't tell you and what you didn't get to know. Um, so a little bit about me and who I am. One of the reasons I think that they didn't talk about me much is I got sorted into, wait for it, Hufflepuff. Yes, guys, I am a badger. Um, no, I, I didn't get sorted in with my brothers and all that. And I think there was kind of a bit of a confusion when, you know, Ron, I got sorted and got sorted into Hufflepuff and so when they sorted Ronald they thought, okay, maybe he's going to go to Hufflepuff too. Nope, he got Gryffindor just like my brothers. Uh, so th they were kind of, you know, dumbfounded about that. Um, but it's alright because I get to be me. I got to, you know, grow up and, and learn with the Hufflepuff students on my own, there wasn't that overshadowing and fear of Fred and George. Um, there wasn't that expectation of being a Weasley uh, in the Hufflepuff house. I was just another student. Um, if you not notice in the first movie, there is a red-headed girl who gets sorted into the Hufflepuff house right before Ronald. Guess who that really is? Um, yes. Don't, 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 you know, it wasn't Susan Boones, though she was with school with us, but she didn't look like that. That's me, but shh, don't tell anybody. Um, but yeah, so I do have my own wand, and once I get my video diaries, uh, I've pretty much got the video diaries I had to send Dad when I found artifacts that he wanted to know exactly what the use was, or weird things that I found that I'm like, what do you guys do with this? And then I found out what they did and I would send, you know, make a, a well, as you guys recall video, we've got our own moving pictures. Um, but I would you know, recall that and send it over to daddy and let him know. So uh, I've collected up a lot of the video diaries, including where I explained to him about a rubber duck. And I'm going to, you know, show them to you guys as well. But gonna hold off on that for a while um, but I will show you my introductional video I do have my own wand it's nice and pretty um, I'm actually sitting here playing with it right now um, I do have a cat uh, actually right now I have two but I do have my own cat I went to school with and like Crookshanks he wasn't too fond of that rat of Ronald's but after knowing what Ronald's rat was, I guess no one really likes him. And there was really good reason not to like that stupid rat. Um, please, if you got any questions, um, comment in the comment below on this video. And then once I get my own channel, which I haven't decided what I'm going to call it yet, um, please feel free to co put comments and ask me questions or. You know, ask me even stuff like my favorite memory at Hogwarts or did my brother really do this or stuff like that. You know, just I'm really interested in what you guys want to know. And I plan on 
just telling you some of my favorite stories. Eventually down the road, I would like to do, you know, commentary on the movies that are out there. You know, actually, if I can figure out how to use these muggle contraptions, these computers are still very new to me. I, I, I've been out of school for many years now, and I still don't understand a lot of this technology. I can't just wave my wand and things happen. I have to click and download and, ugh, I still don't get it. Um, but I would like to figure out, once I can figure out how to do screen on screen kind of stuff, I want to do a uh, movie commentary as well. I really don't know what else I need to talk to you guys about. I feel like there's some other things I want to cover, but we can put them in some of those other videos and with story time and all that. So, yeah, um, really, any questions that you may have, start thinking on them. Um, I've even posted on a couple of uh, th those Facebook pages that are dedicated to my brother-in-law. I know, it's still weird. Uh, so if you see any links posted by my roommate Sharon, th those are probably posted by me because I kind of have to stay hidden a little bit because, you know, you throw the word witch around, the word burning gets thrown around, or somehow people compare me to a duck. I still haven't figured that out yet, but one of these days I'll figure that out. So, yeah, there's a movie, um, Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, about the... Pretty much about um, the the guy who wrote our textbook. Um, it's very interesting to to kind of see how my textbook was written, um, but it's also glad to see and get a reminder that Newt Scamager was a badger just like me. Uh, so that was fun. Um, it was interesting little movie documentary because obviously we know he's been you know he he's he's a lot older than that now and. That that came about quite a while back, uh, so it was interesting to see the actor who played him. And who? Let's hope Newt Scamager looked like that when he was younger. And I've seen him, you know, since then. He's a lot older now, but you know, he's all right to look at. Uh, and just kind of give you an idea. And I, like I said, I plan on doing a little bit more of about me and. You can kind of get to know me as we do talk about these stories and stuff. So, um, uh, unlike my other siblings, I have not gotten married. Uh, pretty much have dedicated my life to my work. Pretty much after graduation, worked with dad, learned a bit in office, and then went off on my travels. Uh, so it, it's it's definitely you know it'd be interesting to find a guy and maybe to work with. But right now. It's just me and my, you know, nomad muggle friends. So, um, that's it. I uh, will hopefully talk to you guys some more and eventually down the road. It'll be a while before I start posting the video diaries. I've still got to get some clarification and make sure it is okay to do and to release before I uh, can put those out into the public. But please look forward to that. Uh, subscribe to this channel. My, my muggle friends channel and eventually once I post mine we'll post the link here and uh, like I said I'll be posting on those Facebook pages as well I might even start up my own Facebook page just so you guys can um, ask some questions on there and post some links and updates on there as well I will talk to you guys later um, thank you so much for supporting my family story uh, and, and you know buying the stuff that you know, has our house stuff on it, has you know, the pictures on it. So thanks for all that. Love you guys so much. Talk to you later. Bye.